So as women, let us go back to the principles of the Bible and give men the leadership God gave them. And let it be. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. You may have all that you have, all the money, you may, you may have the positions, you may have what you have, but give men the rightful pedestal that God gave them by consulting with them. A lot of women do things without even consulting their husbands anymore. That's not the will of God. Consult. A lot of men do things without consulting their husbands anymore. I know of houses hapa mikindani. Ambaye ilikuwa ya member wetu moja aliaga. Lakini hakuambia bibi yake mahali hizo nyumba ziko. Alipoaga na akaenda nyumbani na bibi hakujua. Bibi naye akafuata akazika na kabaki nyumbani. Nyumba zimebaki za nani? Za agent. So wakati mtu anaficha bibi yake Mali yako na mambo yako unajifichia wewe na wakati umejifichia wewe umejifich, umeficha kwa watoto wako ndio watasumbuka because bibi yako anaweza kujisumbua na kuendelea na mambo yake it is your children who will suffer so there is no reason why any family should have secrets from each other over any investment and even your bank accounts. It is so important that your husband knows your ATM number and, uh, and what do you call that? Ile, ile, pin number. Don't give him the ATM, but give him the pin number. She has said he knows. And let your wife know your pin number. If I did not know my husband's pin number, when he passed on, there was money in his account. You all know after a funeral, the church will come in numbers. They will uh, grieve with you. But finally, after burying, everybody goes back to their business. You are left alone. When you come back, Siku hizi ndiyo ninaona kanisa inapiga maisabu hata ya kulipa ile stima na maji metumika. Zamani it was not there. When you come back from the funeral, all the bills are on you. Oh, electricity and water. Everybody has gone back. And normally, pesa ya matanga. Inatumika yote matanga. Watu wa wanasahau kuna maisha baada ya matanga. If I did not know my husband's pin number, I remember hata ile pesa iliyokotwa nyumbani siku ya matanga ya kuzika, nilikuja nikaitishwa na nikapeana. It means I came back with not even a coin from the matanga. If I did not have my husband's pin number, I would not have moved on with life. But because I had this pin number, I went to Barclays Bank, nikaingiza, nikaona pesa, nikalipa electricity bill, water bill. Watoto walikuwa warudi shule. Wakarudi shule. Because there was some money you could access. So when you deny your spouses, your pin numbers, haya mwanamuke, mwanamuke hawezi akajua. Mwanamuke hawezi akajua pin number yako. Na anajua uchi yako. Hata ukikufa sahizi na ubanjuke banjuke uso na kichwa na kila kitu. Hiu ume wake anaiza kusema hii ume ni abuana yangu. Yani ume yako anajua pin number yako ndiyo muhimu kuliko ume wako. Ume, ume wako. Acheni mchezo njini. Kuna ka ukweli hapo. Kuna ka ukweli hapo. <laughs> Nisi jasemu mpatie lakini ajue. Yo ni ngumu. Mbwana asifiwe. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Let us get back God's principles in marriage. Tuwache kuwacha western culture coming to invade us. We have what the Bible says. Let the Bible speak. Wacha watu wakuite wajingjinga. Sababu unafuata sheria za mungu. You will reap at the end. This is Legrand from Simple Generations.